right, Tony, so big win out there for you and the boys tonight. So what were you guys seeing out there? Uh, I think we played well. We put a 60-minute effort tonight, and I think that was key. Uh, previously, we've uh, let down for a period or so, but I don't think that was the case tonight. So you scored your first goal tonight in Steelhead's uniform. Just walk me through what you were seeing out there, and then how does that feel? Um, I've had a bunch of chances uh, this season, so it was good for that first one to go in. But uh, Kess made a great play, shot it on net, um, and Whitey. Kess and Whitey on that two-on-one made a great play. So, uh, yeah, I was just going to the net hard, and it was greasy, but uh, they all count, I guess. All right, Reed, that was a huge goal on the power play there. Tell me what you were seeing out there on the ice. Uh, yeah, uh, we uh, we drew up a play. We had a we had a little uh, meeting uh, before that, and uh, we worked it perfectly, and uh, it was a beautiful pass from Sauce, and uh, just a good shot on that. So a really convincing win for you guys tonight. What are you guys going to do to bring that momentum back here tomorrow night and take the second one? Yeah, I think we're getting on a bit of a roll right now, and uh, we just got to keep uh, going game by game, and uh, and uh, just keep going. All right, so big win tonight, Coach. Uh, just give me your thoughts on the game tonight. Yeah, no, uh, happy with the game. Uh, you know, those are two important points. Um, I really like the way we came out in the third, especially. Um, you know, there was a little bit of feeling out process, I thought, at times in the first, and then we got going. Uh, the second, you know, they had a couple power plays, and, um, you know, it, we were going to need a push to find our energy again for the third, and I thought that's exactly what we did. So uh, happy with how we, uh, we came out there to finish the job, and, um, you know, the guys saw it through to the end, which was very important. So you got a goal from Calderon and from Reed Petrick tonight, AJ White as well. How nice is it to have scoring potential throughout the lines? Yeah, no, well, it's good. Uh, Reader's on a bit of a roll there. I think he has four points in the last three games, and uh, Caldy now has uh, three points in his last two. So they're starting to find their rhythm, starting to find some chemistry. I like the way the lines are uh, put together right now, and um, you know we're rolling them pretty pretty evenly throughout the lineup. So when you can turn the bench over and roll those lines, um, you know everyone's involved, everyone's contributing, and uh, you know the decor was no different. Uh, I'll wait till I get the minutes back, but I'd have to say uh, that it was pretty balanced. And when that's happening, everyone's a part of it. Everyone's contributing. How are you feeling on the the way that the team is drawing penalties? I've noticed that they, they drew and, and they, yeah. they made it a point to draw penalties. How are you feeling on the special well, teams? Well, I, I think the, the big difference is, you know, you can see if we're standing still, you know, they're a hard-working hockey club and, and there's a lot of back pressure. They're hunting from behind. And if you're standing still, they're going to catch up to you. And they were creating some turnovers, um, you know, in our D zone, in our neutral zone. So we have to be a little better there. Um, but then the difference is when we were moving our feet, we were playing with pace, um, you know, we had support coming. Uh, we started to draw penalties. We were starting to go to the outside a little bit. We were starting to use our speed to open up some ice for ourselves, uh, and then we were able to get some power plays off that, and uh, I think it finished one for five or one for six. We'll have to look at it, but um, the power play built momentum. You know, even early when I think it was over two, over three, we had ozone time, we had ozone looks, uh, and then, you know, it was fitting that they got a nice goal there on the four and three, so that was good for us. Do you mainly stick to the game plan of the, the power and speed game when you play the Eastern Conference teams? I know they're mainly known more for their finesse, but do you just stick, stick to your well, game plan? Yeah, I mean, every team's different. So, I mean, you know, that's a pretty big generalization. So, for me, um, you know, we have to, you know, manage what we want to manage. And we have to have our game plan for, you know, um, how we want to play the game, the style we want to play. And then, obviously, you know, we'll make adjustments based on our opponent. Um, you know, but overall, uh, you know, we pre-scout. We had a week to prepare. We knew what they were going to bring. Uh, and they're a good hockey team. So, uh, it was important for us to come out with our plan execute. And I thought we did that. So, what's the big key for you guys? What are you guys focusing on to come back out and take another win tomorrow night? Well, well, we're going to get at the video here tonight. Uh, we'll see where we need to make some adjustments, but um, like I said, I thought the third period we were connected, we were playing faster as a group, so um, that's obviously something we want to carry into.